just about two weeks ago. I was calling on some call service because my mom needed some help with some documents and shit. So I called there and as soon as I picked up and started talking, the guy on the other end was like, whoa, you have such a manly voice. <laughs> For the entire interaction with this guy, he was categorizing me above him. I could see it in his manners and shit. <laughs> so I was like, holy shit, you might like if I give you some tips on how to make your voice more deeper. Because you want to get some bitches, don't you? <laughs> the truth is, by the way, it's kind of dark, but when you have a deeper voice, people instantly assume you are higher status than you probably even are. That is simply because when you are speaking in depth, you have to be relaxed to do that. And to be relaxed, you have to be confident in the situation you are in. There is some biological shit. I can't explain to you exactly why that is, but girls will like you more. And also, more guys will be able to be responsible on you. There are a few techniques that you can use to make your voice deeper. This works for everyone. You can't sound exactly like Corpse Husband. Hello, I like eating things. But you can definitely make the most out of your potential, the most out of your voice. By the way, if you feel like I speak a little bit weird, it's because I'm a little bit sick, so... That's why I'm wearing this hat, and that's why I am in the jacket outside. <laughs> but the obvious one is that you should breathe more deeper into your belly. And that is because when you deep breathe, <laughs> what? when you breathe deeply into your belly, you can relax your body more. Your body's more relaxed and you can actually open up the stomach, which when you're, <laughs> which when the sound is coming from your stomach, it will sound more rich. It will sound more manly and dominant. And generally, I told you that if you are relaxed, your voice will automatically be deeper. So if you breathe through your nose throughout the day into your belly and speak from your diaphragm, that will automatically make it deeper. Holy fuck. Someone's getting murdered, bro. <laughs> yeah. Don't know if I can put this on YouTube. <laughs> Just kidding. Is the kids here playing? Here's the sunset, by the way, I'm gonna show you later. This is something you can do every day. The goal here is to be as relaxed as you possibly can be. Because when you are all tensed up, you you can you kind of speak like this, like, yeah, kind of fucking weird, man. But when you are relaxed, you can easily touch that diaphragm. But when we dive deeper into the, like, specific techniques, how to make it deeper and more richer, there are a few ones, so let's go through them. The one technique you should use every time you speak is down talking. That's exactly what I did right now. That's when you end the sentence with a lower tone. Like you don't go up, but you go down. An example of this would be, yo, how are you? That's when you go up. It's kind of cringe, but I have to demonstrate to you. And then when you go down, it's like, how are you today, my friend? <laughs> fucking, I was speaking to a wall. <laughs> There's a fucking wall right here. <laughs> what I have found, this works so well with girls because it makes you seem more confident and more dominant, more calm. But don't get me wrong, this also works in normal conversations. People are gonna perceive you better. And when you couple it with the next tip is when you speak slower with it. Imagine if I spoke to a girl like this, with a nice smile on my face, confidence, and with some really pleasant eye contact, right? She would instantly like dump her boyfriend and go like, <laughs> jump on my bed or something. <laughs> <laughs> but out of these two, the better one is definitely down talking. Try to practice down talking. Every time you speak to someone, end the sentence with a lower tone. Another thing that could work is... <clears throat> yeah, and that could definitely, like, when you clear your throat, it will get rid of the excess bullshit that's in your throat, and you can actually use it to speak more in depth. <clears throat> <laughs> I'm literally doing this before the fucking cuts, man. <laughs> Between the cuts. When I touch my stomach, I can... I can feel the sound coming from there. Probably like here in my upper area of stomach, but I can definitely feel it here. Most people, when they speak, they can only feel it here. Try to really like move it down a bit. Try to move it at least into your chest. And if you can, into your belly. But that can be done with breathing exercises. If you can do breathing exercises daily, that will deepen your breath and that will actually make your voice deeper. This wouldn't be a Lucasino video without a weird trick. <laughs> right? When I was younger, I always saw this one guy. I don't remember his name on YouTube. And he had a fucking deep voice. 
His voice was deeper than my fucking subwoofer, bro. And he always said, screaming therapy. And I was like, what the fuck? Should I go to a therapy and scream at the therapist or what? <laughs> no. The technique here is that you should get all of your trapped emotions in your body out of it by screaming as loud as you can. And that way you will be more relaxed and will be able to deepen your breath even more. In my experience, this actually worked. But sometimes when I fucking overdid it, <laughs> my throat was sore the next day, I couldn't speak. But this actually works when you don't overdo it. The absolute best way to do this right now that I found is go find the song, any song, where a singer has a deep voice. I'm gonna link a song below, but try to find a song and learn the lyrics and try to sing with him and try to really sing from the depth of your belly that way you will unlock all of the trapped shit that's right here and also here and you will be able to speak deeply holy shit the sun is setting bro let me show you shit hey sunset brother <laughs> pray for something <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. Hopefully the light will be still good. When you think about it, it makes sense because when you scream at the top of your lungs, you will feel more relaxed after it, right? Another tip, brother, is what is your normal voice without trying to speak deeper? Identify that voice and try to speak 20% deeper, just a little bit. Let's, let me speak right now. This is my normal voice. I'm not trying anything. And this is when I try to speak a little bit deeper. When you speak in this a little bit deeper voice, more, you will kind of train it. You will train your vocal cords, your throat. You will train these muscles to speak more in depth. And that way, your normal voice, after a time, will be deeper. I like to compare this to a progressive overload at the gym. We all know that, right? You progressively add more weight and shit to the bar. And then your warm-up weight is someone's PR. <laughs> right so this way your voice will get deeper and richer over time the last step brother is to become more muscular increase your testosterone levels this alone will be probably the biggest and the best tip i can give you if you become more masculine your voice will automatically become deeper and i've heard that <laughs> <laughs> bro online people talk about oh when i don't fat for seven days my voice is deeper <laughs> how stupid that sounds bro when i don't masturbate for seven days my voice is deeper what the fuck you know why it's because when you don't masturbate your testosterone goes up and that will impact your voice and the depth of it which will also impact your confidence and the, the relaxation of your body like 24-7. When you have more testosterone, you'll feel more relaxed throughout the day during a conversation. But these motherfuckers talk to you about like, oh, when I don't jerk off for seven days, I have superpowers. I'm gonna fucking punch them in the face, bro. Idiots, fucking geeks, man. This is everything I know and I did to improve the depth and the richness of my voice. Try to use all of these techniques and I guarantee that you will see success. My friend, I appreciate you for staying in and listening to me. If you have watched by now, you might as well just subscribe so you don't miss anything that could significantly <laughs> deepen your voice. <laughs> so go ahead and click the subscribe button and my friends, I'm gonna see you in another video.